You okay there? Working it all out. Once and for all, Arthur. Mm. What now? We're back. And I'm sitting here. And I am contemplating the great journey of the sun and considering a famous chess move. Those oily enactors of a mediocre justice, the Pinkertons, and their benefactor, the depressing millionaire, Leviticus Cornwall, they want us, Arthur. They want us. And they are going to have us. Well, maybe they ain't the problem. Meaning? I don't know. It's just... Well, I can't help but feel we would have been better running off someplace else. <laughs> but the, the game ain't over, Arthur. I mean, I ain't, I ain't played my... My final move, but I guess I'm more interested in surviving than winning a chess. And maybe life ain't such a thing to cling on to so tightly. No doubt. What's our move here? You sound like Hosea. I miss. Um, I asked you a question. What do you think? We can't stay here. That much is obvious. Where are we gonna run to? I mean, they chased us from the west. They chased us over the mountains. They ran us into the sea. Arthur, do you have my back? Always, Dutch. But there's more than your back to worry about. We need more money. We've been on the run for months now, and I seen you killing folk in cold blood like you always told me not to, and I'm sorry, but I can't help but think that if we There is country in Roanoke Ridge past Butcher Creek. I believe we could hold. Okay. You and Charles, you could take folks up that away. Micah. How you holding up? Great. Charles. Be right with me. Always. Where are we headed? Up past Butcher Creek. Murphy Brew Country. That's why I'm asking you to ride with me. I understand. What are we doing there? We're looking for a place to hold up. Even the law won't follow us up there too willingly. Really. Yeah. I did some scouting up there while your boys were away. And? Mm. We'll see. Oh. I know the way. Follow me. Been too long, girl. We need to get this done fast. Pinkertons will have reinforced in another day or two. Yeah. The sooner we get out of here, the better. It's quite a ride up there. I saw some canoes near the bridge up river, which would take us right up to Butcher Creek. Might be quicker. What do you think? Well, I see one anyway. That'll do. Come on. Okay. Butcher Creek is a few miles up river. So I spent some time up this way while you were gone. I ran into rains fall and the eagle flies. The Indians? And I've been trying to help out a bit where I can at the reservation. Things are bad there. That's not a surprise. They seem to be in a lot of trouble and heading in the more. Some men there spoke a lot about the Murphy gang that hides out in these caves. And we're gonna need to be careful. They're animals. Everyone is terrified of them. Great! Dutch didn't mention this. Well, hiding up here, it's not a crazy idea. This is a spot. But he comes near, even the law. Just be ready. It won't be pretty. So be it.
Hunter Creek up ahead. Who are they? The locals. Well, they don't look too friendly. Wait till you meet the Murphys. All right, let's walk it from here. You know how we get to the caves at Beaver Hollow? You'll get away if you don't want Come on, they're not gonna help us. I'm pretty sure it's to the north, up the road here. See why folks don't want to come around here. Ain't exactly a welcoming place. Lots of stories of people going missing around these parts. Oh, come on. Just recently, a stagecoach from Annisburg disappeared without a trace coming through here. Guess that's good for us. Assuming these inbred bastards are willing to part with their home, which I'm sure they won't be too pleased about. No, but I believe they hide out all over Roanoke Ridge. These caves are just one of their spots, which is why we should keep it down. They might have lookouts around. Okay. You see that up ahead? Slow down, keep it quiet. It could be some of them. I say we dismount here and follow them on foot. See where they're going. Let's get closer to him. Come on, up this way. Definitely Murphy's. I say we deal with them from here. You take one, I'll take the other. Because I do the skinning. Well, how about I do the skinning? Then who do the carrying? You're a son of a bitch. You stupid. That was close. Uh, we must be close now. Let's stop and have a look from the top of this hill there. I might be safer. Yeah. Let's be quiet and hope they don't come out. Let's get this over with.
we're gonna... Looks like it's on then, Charles! Where are you from? Vandersburg. What do we do with her? You take her there and I'll go get the others. Sure. Miss, you okay to ride on my horse a little? I'll keep you safe. Vandersburg, <laughs> right? Yes. Place is yours. Up at the top of the hill. It's near the blacksmith. Mama. Ma! Ma! Meredith! She's alive! Oh, she's alive! You saw some pretty bad things, I'm afraid, man. Murphy Brute guys. Oh my god. How did you manage to? I just ran into them and found her. Oh, thank you. Here, let me give you this. Oh, that, that's okay, ma'am. You just keep her warm and keep her safe. <sighs> this is Dalf. Oh, no. You leave me alone. You just leave me alone. Thanks, buddy. How you get on? Okay. Found a girl. Took her home. Oh. You and Micah find anything? Maybe. I think maybe. I found our old friend, Mr. Cornwall. You did? Yeah. He's buying a stake in the mine in Annisburg. Relentlessly ambitious fella, isn't he? Mike and I'll sniff about, see if he knows we're here, and exactly what his plans are. So, Dodge! Did you miss me? I found her! 
Drunk as Saint Denis. You're back. How jolly, Miss it's O'Shea. It's funny, you suck of shit. Back Who and are you? drunk. The master, the Lord Molly. God, all my. Calm down. I won't be ignored. Dutch Vanderlyn, I am in him. I ain't her. I need it. Stooges! Calm yourself. You don't owe me nothing! Miss! I don't owe you nothing! Nothing! Okay! I'll spit in your eye! I did! I told them! I'm sorry? Yeah, I told them, I tell them again! Now I've got God's ear! You told who? What? Mr. Milton and Mr. Ross about the bank robbery, and I wanted them to kill you! You did what? I loved you, you goddamn bastard! Go on, shoot She's me! Crazy. She ain't worth it. You told on me! Oh, you betrayed so me! What? Right. Calm down. Arthur? <laughs> He's a fool. Get her out of here. You know the rules. You are not so big now. Are we, Your Majesty? You. Take her! <laughs> she knew the rules, Arthur. What the hell is wrong with you? Mr. Pearson, Mr. Williamson, get this body out of here and get it burnt. Okay. Now get back to work, all of you! Quit your lollygagging! Right. Get back to work! Yeah.